Hello, this is Hussam Hurani, and we will continue our lessons in data manipulation on Arch data mining. And today we'll talk about discretize and uh, continuous uh, the values uh, from data sets. So we will use uh, as an example uh, two data sets, the Iris data sets. As you can see, they are continuous values and Titanic, they are uh, discrete values. So how can we change this and how can we change the values, normalize the values and do some uh, some uh, changes uh, in uh, features uh, shapes. So let's let's uh, do this and we will uh, uh, directly go to orange data mining and the first one we will go with Titanic data set. So this is the Titanic. So we have four features. Uh, or th three features and the one uh, the target so we have status age six and survive let's see the values the values for uh, as in data table this is the data table for the data as, as you can see uh, we have the survive yes no status first second third uh, and crew status age uh, adult or child and six male female now we can uh, do um, continuous continuous by choosing this attribute okay so once you double click you can choose whatever you want to do for example treat as uh, treat the categorical features the categorical features as what treat as or ordinal once we do this you will have the whole categorical feature changed into values uh, let's just connect to data table and these are the values as you can see from this one we changed from this one to uh, this one so uh, status instead of having first second third we have zero one two th one two three and age is zero one and uh, six male female one zero okay so we change the whole thing into these values so this is one uh, shape or one thing and but you have different options you can uh, treat them all or you can use them all uh, the way that you want so for example we have first value as a base most frequent values as a base as a categorical features this is for categorical features ignore uh, multinomial attributes remove uh, categorical uh, attributes uh, treat as uh, ordinal which we done now uh, divide by a number of values these are the features or the things that you can use also if it's numeric features you can do some normalization some you can scaling you can do many things and also for the uh, categorical outcome leave it as is or treat as ordinal etc so this is uh, the first example uh, we uh, done the uh, continuous the second one is uh, we're gonna use um, iris data set iris data set and this is our target okay and from iris data set as you can see this is the data from uh, data table uh, you can see that we have continuous values in all these features so for example uh, if we need to uh, rescale this values and do some maybe normalization we can uh, do continuous also continuous and we can for example uh, all the numerical features uh, we can normalize to interval from minus one to one from minus one to one let's see the results data table okay and these are the values between my minus one and one so we change all the values between minus one and one as you can see here okay so this is one one operation you can do but also you have different operations and continuous as uh, i highlighted you can scale you can uh, center to specific values you can do all the standardize you can do all these uh, things okay this is the first one second one we, i will use the um, discrete discretize discretize this is the discretize so these are the values can we discretize for them, uh, change them from uh, continuous to discrete? Yes, we can. So we can come here and per each value, we can, for example, keep the, uh, do this as intro by MDL discretization. We can keep this as this one. We can change this into equal frequent dis, uh, discretization and number of intervals two or three or four, whatever you want. And we can also change this into equal with discretization to five uh, intervals and the last one we can remove remove this attribute and based on this you can see the new uh, changes as you can see here the whole thing changed so simple length uh, it's we have now uh, 
intervals as you can see we have less than 5.5 5.5 uh, to 6.15 etc and also uh, the same uh, with sibyl width we change it and sibyl length and we remove the uh, petal uh, width uh, from this attribute so this is uh, all uh, things that you can do of course you can create something here and you can make it as default okay so you can change this as a default this is the default values and if you have for example many attributes you can do some uh, operations here and once you set and you cre create that this will apply to the default it will take all the default uh, chosen um, you know attributes and features so this is the uh, decretize and the uh, continuous uh, values and how to use them it's straightforward it depends on your values but as i said earlier you can do uh, and clean your data and you can create it manually or through excel sheets or through any sheets applications uh, and you might not need for this one but this is a feature that uh, is in orange data mining you have the freedom to use it it's i think it's uh, very uh, good features that we can use to uh, manipulate our data before we do training and prediction so this is the lesson for today i hope that you enjoyed it and we'll see you in our next lesson till then bye